Okay. Okay. So all other team members can write their opinion on the discussion election, as I mentioned on the other slide, you know. So, I mean, beside the product owner, none of the team member can change the user story. They don't yeah. have this authority to, you know, change it. Okay, bugs, as our lecturer said, when you're developing, deploying, or testing, you find something like you are stuck, you cannot proceed. You don't just sit down, you create a bug. So the product owner knows what's going on. So, you know, the yeah. product owner or the business team, or actually the development team, team the I mean, team, it's yeah. not, it's nothing to do with the business team actually. So all the development team can come up with a solution instead of just, you know, like getting stuck in one place. Yeah. All right, okay. Wiki. Uh, you're good, it's fine. Okay, it's fine. all right. So basically I was having a little bit of um, like hard time understanding Wiki, but like I'll try my best to explain. It's gonna help me. So Wiki is like all the high level information related to the project. Re related to the project are stored on the Wiki. So know. everybody can read. Everybody yeah, can like read. Knowledge base. Knowledge right. base. He knows. Yeah. You, you have to do that, right? Yeah, I know. He has to do that. So in every project, like when you're working, knowledge should not be everybody's brain. Yeah, yeah. The when something you use every day, it should go to the documented process. And that's the call the wiki. Yeah, wiki uh, knowledge base means. Suppose you are working with a specific doctor and you you uh, face a new issue. So you solve the issue. So how will you solve the issue? You write it down. That's okay. it. Hmm? Yep. Or uh, some of the information people yeah. need. So the problem solving, right? Yeah. yeah well, as you can, yeah, you can say it is a problem solving yeah. platform or something. So like you, that. you shouldn't ask someone yeah. uh, how you do that. What's yeah. possible because you can get the yeah, in professional work, it does not it yeah. does not work like that. You yeah. cannot just go to someone, hey, can you help me do that? Yeah. No, you don't do it. I mean, it's not professional at all. Yep. All right, next slide. V model. Oh, he has it here. Okay. Well, yeah, go ahead. Good. Okay. So V model is the sequencing process of, I mean, that actually applies in the online automotive industries. Yep. So here is the like the process. I mean, I couldn't write that diagram, but like I'll cover it. Recommend testing, system testing. System design. System design, architect, architect, architecture architecture design, design, module design, unit testing, integration, integration testing, testing, system testing, and the acceptance testing. So basically, the reason why I highlighted these three only, so these three, the integration, system, and acceptance, these are only done by the actual company. Let's say like GM is building a car or a vehicle. These three will only done by the GM. And all the other five will be done by the supplier companies. Mix and match, yes. So yeah, the mix and match. because requirement actually come from the GM. So remember, yeah, that, yeah. remember because the OEM own everything. They do not develop anything. They want to build a product, a module. Just the uh, you you will be coming to the twenty twenty six model. They want the car have the the what is called the camera in the four all the four side. That's, That's right. what they want. So they want to build the ECU. So who is going to give the requirements to GM? GM. GM engineering team will write the whole details requirement. And then and they will record it. But you can write it. Yes, sir. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. 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 Hey, it says iPhone 6, unmuted. Okay, who is FF? I think it's Fatima. No, you need to speak. You know, you need to speak. Okay, so let's FF. If you do not talk, we remove the people. It is the. And the iPhone, if you do not talk. Yeah, we have to remove you, sorry. iPhone, you need to talk as well. Well, change your name. <clears throat> yeah, you change or you need to speak up. Okay, so let's see. Where's the iPhone? Lost it. Probably okay. that person. Sure. Got out. All right, so <clears throat> S-Pace. So basically the S-Pace is an acronym, the actual uh, meaning of the Automotive Software Process Improvement and the capability de determination. So that thing was created to access all the performance of the development process of the OEM suppliers in automotive industry. So like, if you guys don't know, I mean, I think most of the people knows what is OEM. It's like original equipment manufacturer, you know, 
That's the actual meaning of OEM. Yeah, you, you, we asked this question. OEM means who own the Shilu making the product. Yeah. Go ahead. And um, go ahead. sorry, uh, Shilu Wei. Um, for your last um V uh, shaped model, mm -hmm. you said there is system design, architectural design, module design, unit design. What the difference between them? So everything is start with the same example. If you come with the requirement, you'll be learning more details. The engineering team, if you just come up with the requirements, right? It need to be designed. Architecture need to be designed. The people who write the requirement, they don't know how to design it. it means that the, how it will be actually developed. Before the develop, it goes to the design page. That's the word the architecture design the, based on the requirements. And then the development <laughs> happens. Development happens so again. We have to design the model or no. we have to write it. Designing, designing it depends have the own team. Whenever architecture, that's the job of the architect, not you. Okay. Depends on the job. Yes, yeah. you, you, in, in our course, we do not teach anybody architect. Okay. Just like architecture engineer or like yeah. design engineer, they have a different team. So that's the different role, you know. design engineer. Mm -hmm. I was architect, so I have to design the whole thing, how it should work. And then it goes to the development team. We don't have to design anything. No, no, no you are not. In the, in the key unless case, you are a design engineer, yeah, you have to. Unless work. you get hired for the architect or the <laughs> design engineer. Yeah, good? Yes. So this is the, the, the follow. Otherwise, you just, uh, if you do not design it, and if you develop something, it does not work. Think about the OEM point of view. 10 million vehicles will be messed up. It's not the money, it's about the time. So that's the reason they follow very strict process. After the requirements come, it needs to be system design, architecture design is super important. They actually have a sign up process. The architecture design has to be signed up, then it goes to the actual, the, the, the vendor means who is going to write the code. Yeah, go ahead. Yeah, so I was talking about the airspace or like um, we already covered the airspace. OEM, as we know, the original equipment sub, sub, manufacturer or the supplier company, what do you call, you know. Kanban, it is a platform that helps to be, I mean, you can visualize your work. Same, you can, same like Agile Scrum. Yeah, Agile right? Scrum. You can like literally see what needs to improve or like, like what you've done on the previous, week or month and what, what are the action that you can take to improve your work, you know? That's all about the, I mean, th that's all Kanban is all about, you know? So Agile, Agile, has, Agile is the parents company you can call, parents yeah. process. Agile has so many framework. Or oh, the so many like, a, what is called the model? I don't know, the Scrum called the framework. Kanban is another one. And the Lean, another one. And the simple one is Agile, good? Yeah. So it's all under so the Agile. Kanban is under Agile, right? Huh? Kanban is yeah. under Agile. Exactly. Agile Kanban. Agile, Agile Scrum. Agile, Agile, Scrum. Agile Kanban. Agile Lean. So as long as so. you know you are a good team member working in one environment, you are good. If you go a spice, they have the all same model, actually. You go where? But in the Agile, that's when people work simultaneously. Nobody can sit idle. Somebody has to do something. In the B model, waterfall, it's like the slow model. One part has to be done, then the other part is stirred. That part is done, the next part is stirred. Because they have to be careful because it's complex. OEM, government job, very complex. So they follow the, the waterfall or the, the B model because this is the nature of the project that you follow the environment. Now OEM is trying to follow the agenda scrum, they do. Some part they do, but they cannot fully no, they cannot. follow. So if you become an agile player, you can be playing everywhere in the world, anywhere. Any project you can play because you are the Agile member. And they will right away, they will say, oh yeah, you know the work, okay? All right, so actually, I mean, before, wait. Before okay. I say thank you, do you guys have any questions for me? Well, you guys ask Shibluvai if you guys, well, I was the presenter, if you guys have any question, you can just ask. No, very nice. Uh, how do you make the presentation? Yeah, set up a meeting with him. <laughs> okay, yeah, you can set up a meeting with yeah. me. And I'll show you how to do that. Right, right. Thank, you. thank you. Very nice job. So you guys see that you guys did Very not nice do the. Why did you do that? I was just like, I was kind of nervous. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. 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 You heard that? The, it's nerve wracking, yeah. right? But you see this. So well, you are, I feel, I think last time I, I presented was like four years ago. So yeah. Like, so, it's a long gap. So. See, but you have in the a live and probably you have to face every day. Every week we have a meeting. Right? So we have to talk to them. You see that? Yeah, we have oh, that's why you get yeah, used to it. Yeah. So I will uh, okay, fix the fix the the ground the the like a uh, spelling spelling 
those kind of things. You see this, when you do this, then you learn. Until you do, you never learn. So one thing right down in, you say, I know everything, but you don't know anything until you do it. Okay, guys, so let's stop this.